I'm Rajiv Mangal, Vice President, Safety, Health and Sustainability at Tata Steel. Welcome to Grinovation, our new Leadership Sustainability Series. As you are aware, June is celebrated as Sustainability Month. But for us in Tata Steel, it's not only a celebration, but a commitment to future. In 2020, Tata Group embarked upon an ambitious environment sustainability project, Project Alingana. For the group and for Tata Steel, 2045 has been set as a target to achieve net zero. In Netherlands, we operate a 6 million ton integrated steel plant and the need of the hour is to decarbonize over there. Apart from taking steps to reduce emissions, the journey of decarbonization will require both carbon direct avoidance as well as offset of the carbon that we have generated. Tata Steel launched the first carbon bank in the country and it is very much operational now. Apart from taking steps to reduce emissions in the manufacturing process, Tata Steel has also taken pioneering efforts in the entire value chain. With the availability of CNG, we are gradually increasing our proportion of CNG-based finished steel movement. Tata Steel transports a lot of finished goods and steel throughout the country. Steel industry will need active engagement of consumers, manufacturers, and the policy makers. Tata Steel plays an active role in working with the ministry as well as with the Steel Association to generate meaningful and relevant policies in the country. Thank you for joining us in the first episode of Renovation. Let's shape the change. Let's lead it.